We are in Bradenton this afternoon, just north of Sarasota, near some of the areas that are expected to be the hardest hit by this very powerful hurricane Ian. Right now, the conditions feel like a mild tropical storm, but we know over the next couple of hours, it is going to get much worse. We're also protecting ourselves using buildings to keep some of that wind from really wearing us out. But if you take a look behind, you'll see that these gusts are coming through. They are stronger and they are more frequent. At times, we're getting some heavy rain bands. We were on the highway on I-75, certainly moved the vehicles around right there. And we know in the coming hours, it is going to get much worse. We checked with police in Northport. That's near Port Charlotte. And they just sent out an announcement to residents and visitors. They are saying no more emergency services. So the winds are over 45 miles an hour, meaning they're not going to be sending out the fire trucks, the ambulances and the police vehicles. So they're asking people to stay in their homes, to stay safe. And they're saying this is a good example of why you should evacuate when the storm is coming your way, because as of now and for the next several hours, potentially into the middle of the night, there are not going to be emergency services in that area or some of the other hardest hit areas. Right now, we're starting to hear some things banging. We're seeing some trim, uh, tree limbs down. Again, very, very mild compared to what we expect to see in the coming hours. Of course, we are going to keep you posted. For now, we are in Bradenton. I'm Vic Michelucci.